Over 26. <laughs> this is the Park of Post. This is the Brunch Club. Over 26. The mics are genius. Now, when you watch it, you'll understand. <laughs> What up, my name is Chaxi, the mastermind, <laughs> you are main guy, the Lord Chaxi, the beautiful Mariah is around. The master the amazing behind. Mwas amazing. He's around, the master behind, <laughs> the whole gang is around. This is episode 33, Mark Chuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, this was posted on 27th of uh, September. Mm-hmm. It was a poll on the Mike Check uh, Twitter. <laughs> and it read, Oh my gosh. Who, hold up. Who do you think took a shit <laughs> most recently? Chaxi. Chaxi, Mwas, Mariah. You were just guess, talking about taking a shit right now. Who, guess who, guess who Mwas. just took a Guess who just took a shit <laughs> most recently? Mwas. But it's really strange because Chaxi is the one who's always talking about taking a shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Also, right now. Right now, like, before we recorded this, it was like, do I take a shit right now? That's a lie because the Lord does not shit. We told you that. I just said it. Okay. The Lord does check, not shit. Check it. Anyway, so Can I, uh, I want someone who has the mic. Who has the mic? Who has the mic? So, who do you think took a shit most recently, right? <laughs> 64 votes. 64 votes. Who do you think won? Who has the mic? Who has the mic? No, get the mic. If you want to talk, get the mic. So that we can have it in the recording. You said Mwas. Um, you have a different opinion? Ray? Uh, same. So, Mwas, you, are, you guys are right. Bro. Out of 64 votes, 64% <laughs> said Mwas. 26.6% said Mariah. No. And then I got 9.4. That's I'm a lady. four of Mariah's super accounts. What Mariah make, voted with four, four what for makes me. You think so no. clearly, I'm a lady. No, 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 the Lord no, no, no. doesn't shit. I'm going to say this. <laughs> You know, there, there, the there's, there's, there's sexism, there's homophobia, there's, there's any... There's shitism. Fatism and shitism is a thing. I don't know that it's a thing. I'm a but lady. Generally, but generally, no, 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 did you take no, no, a shit no, no, no. today? Did you take a shit today? I did. At your house. <laughs> at your house. I did no, not wait, take wait. a shit today. Did you take a shit today? No. So, of course, so most recently still. is <laughs> no, uh, First of all, it's true. <laughs> Second of all, I'd like to say this. Oh, yeah. I have nothing to say. Because <laughs> so, I'm, not, I'm not full of shit. Yeah. Guess why? <laughs> no. They took one. <laughs> oh, it's not full of shit because it took one. <laughs> I can't. Let's go. I oh, can't. My no, but I'm very so offended about, that you guys yeah. could vote me over Chaxi. Listen, I'm a lady. I don't shit. Women the shit. The Lord does women, women shit. shit. <laughs> ah, it smells the worst. <laughs> <laughs> like you love someone no, until, until you have... Let me, see, let, see, let me just ask. <laughs> yeah. Which girls are those that you know? Yeah. Because uh, but, yo, but me, I'm just, I'm just like, our people know the Lord does not shit. Because I told you, only Mariah voted Chaxi with her four pseudo accounts. Chaxi, Nicola, <laughs> so the I, I have one account which I'm barely <laughs> on. Is <laughs> But of anyway, course, with my yeah. account, I actually voted for yeah. you. I won't front. Uh, you see? I won't front. <laughs> <laughs> Mariah, you already told I us. Voted from us. <laughs> you already told us. You have more Twitter accounts than I voted than from your us. Bank yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? More Twitter accounts than bank accounts. Can you imagine? <laughs> it's true. See, but it's yeah. okay. bank accounts is enough. It depends on I how much like money you have. Because yeah. what's the point of having bank accounts that have nothing? Facts. You know what I mean? May have to do two of them. <laughs> <laughs> You've seen my account balance. Wait, on Lord Sheeta, <laughs> <Ebu, laughs> relax there. <laughs> Don't call me Sheeta. Lord Sheeta, <laughs> relax. I can say me a genie. I'm going to say me a genie. I'm going to say me a genie. I'm going to Listen, talking about Twitter, <laughs> I'm switching this up. So talking about Twitter, uh-huh. um, I'm getting back to because our next con- our next conversation is of course checkpoints. That's okay. how we begin the show, and this is from a conversation that was being had on Twitter, right? Okay. Yeah. Uh, just, uh, and, uh, I just and I just want to say we we made a co- we we, uh, we we mentioned that we needed to do like a montage for checkpoint, yeah. and two two of our listeners sent us montage. Can you, yeah. Yeah. Can you guys? Man. That episode came out on Wednesday. Wait, Wednesday you... night, I had a montage on my email. The following Bro. man Thursday had a second montage on our email. Bless you, Shout guys, out all of you. Bless, yeah. uh, Bless Then you. we talked about invading campuses, and we we're like, if any uni reach out, someone from MKU said they'll they'll be they they fully take over MKU. Dopeness. Dopeness. Twin, uh, then someone from uh, J Quart as well said. Jack, what is the responsibility? And you, you're handling KU. You. Oh, and you know, because okay. me, I never finished uh, <laughs> university. I'm, I'm still a student. To, to me, so back to me, so you, choir. You know, I'm an alumni. You Listen, know, I'm an alumni. alumni. I can't go me, back. Jack, what Nick already represents. Uh, Jack, what Nick already represents. If you're from choir, if you're from choir, and if you're from choir, 
If you're from uh, Desta, if you're from Desta Yusta, if you're from Igaton, if you're from Maseno, if you're from Pwani University, please reach out. Yeah, 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 we, we all need the your places. Help. Just help. reach out. So shout out to Mike Check. Bro. Mike Check fans. Bless you guys, ah, man. Bless ah, you guys. I feel Bless like, you guys. No, 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 no. I feel like this is a very dope episode because yes. we spent the weekend together. Oh! Ah, my God. Ah, Can we talk about how... Oh, oh, no, for the first time, Maria pulled up to the phone. You pulled up late. I actually and pulled up to the phone. Okay. What's the agency? So, so thing is, no, ah, agency. Yeah. Ashere, agency. Nini. Ma Ma your best. best. <laughs> oh, please. Actually, our episode title is Ma 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 your best. Akuna agency for me. Let's go. Yo, I so, pulled up. We had a good time. Friday. What were you guys doing on Friday? Because uh, we were together on Friday. Oh shit! See, why were you guys, guys on your round? You ran my errands on Friday with me, yeah. man. Come on. Yo, By force. First Thank of all, you. let's let's appreciate it. World Podcast Day Friday. Shout out to Trace. Uh, Honestly, no, no, no. Let's yeah. nah, 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 nah. Uh? Bless them for having us. To be honest, Jackson. <laughs> fuck radio. Man. Don't do that. And Don't then, fine. I'm just saying, fuck radio. Bless them for having us. We had us. the unfortunate experience of spending the whole day with Jackson. Yeah. yeah. And then, in his car, he was Hostage. driving around. Bro, yeah. FYI. Every three minutes, there's a phone call. I'm Listen, like, where? When I'm a business guy in Nairobi. Sasa. <laughs> the first 25 <laughs> minutes, it was hello. Eh, okay. Two, okay. Okay. Hello? Aya. Sawa. Ah, okay. Let me talk two, to Mariah. Okay. okay Mariah. Let me talk to Mwan. Okay. Where? Yeah. Skia. Let me talk to Chatsi. Skia. I'm like, bro. Stop sending your prayer requests. The Lord is tired. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Chatsi, that is Stop sending your prayer requests. That is the nicest joke you've made. I'm proud. The only. The I'm only. I'm proud. The only. The only. That's a good joke. Yo. So uh, when we when we're on radio, what's in your car? So, uh, so bro, Nick. can you you know I don't have my voice. <laughs> At least the last two episodes I had my voice. The last two episodes. So I'm back to default settings. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we're talking about our weekends. Then we get into checkpoint. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So we're beginning on Friday. Yeah. So Friday we get on air. Uh, of course we are the showstoppers. So we are the last. <laughs> of course. Episode. We are closing Save the, the show. Best for last. Save the best for last. Uh, then we met some groupies, like Sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, oh, Sandwich are hilarious, bro. bro. They are hilarious. Listen, we met Sandwich. I met Mantok, Eli. Shout out to Eli. Mm. I met TMI. That's Muruki. That's Muni. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing people. You guys yeah. love what you Yo. guys are doing. Amazing content. Love it. Yeah. Keep Yo, it. Sandwich are crazy. Hilarious. Yo, you can imagine us and Sandwich. The ba- bro, the band. The whole of for Trace two minutes. was just like, yeah. what the hell is going Trace on here? Trace went wild because us and Sandwich just I love back to back, back. No, 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 no. The, the funniest bit was it's yeah. an office setting. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone guys, is silent. Guys are just on their you? emails. <laughs> <laughs> like this. <laughs> and then eight random niggas are just like... <laughs> 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 That's crazy. Yo, it's so, crazy. Uh, okay, we, this one we can't disclose now, but ep- episode 52, watch out. Yeah. For yeah. yeah. Um, so... Then we get on air, the la- what, just one thing, and then we, we bounce into okay. Saturday, because yeah. this is Friday still, right? Yeah. <laughs> so they, they say oh, shit. that <laughs> we should, together, yeah. yeah, we should, not three days for me and you, then that's two today. with Mariah. Three. Oh, three. What do you mean, me and Mariah? I was there with you on Friday. What are you talking about? Okay, but, three but, for but you all. spend the night with us. Okay, ili kwani fanya jeff to zangu Saturday ndio ni kuje. Any other jam. So anyway, so ni me switchi because I can. So, uh. The, the thing about is now, so Calvin asks that we need to say one thing about each other. Each other. You can't yeah, say like, no, about like, you. um, he yeah. a- actually, no, he said we need to characterize each other's personalities on how we are on the podcast, and yeah. you're not yeah. allowed to say what your personality is. Yeah, let the others give you your personality. So, yeah. Chaxi was the mastermind, Moss was absolutely the comedian. And can the you imagine the they the gave me the hater? I'm the Lord. Yo, okay. you, we gave you the mastermind. What's up, Bush? Come on, connect to me. We both. gave you the mastermind. In your agenda, Moas was the comedian. You guys yeah. gave me the hater. And you even made Calvin call me Stinkmina. It's true. And literally, less than a second later, you hated me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> even hated you. She was on the I know you're hating me. Nah, nah. You're hating nah, the conversation. A, listen, <laughs> and let, let's just switch on record. I'm a realist, but yeah. just with a pinch of salt. Uh, so you can call me Riley. Whatever, you know. man. So that's Friday. Uh, Mariah decides to boot us. Moas and I... Go to the crib and then we have a crazy DJ said beautiful. Bro, that, was that was beautiful. Bro, bro, bro. Fra- that's Friday. Moving on. So, ah. so Saturday. Bro, bro. No, so Saturday. no, 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 no. Before you get to Saturday, Jaxi had a bottle of tequila. Mm-hmm. I had a bottle of gin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then he says, I'm only gonna drink this much. <laughs> And then he does, he does, he does drink that much. And then I check the bottle. He's like, the kitchen. tomorrow, guys, we have a long day. I'm gonna drink this much. Okay, yeah. guys, was me. <laughs> <laughs> and then takes the bottle to the kitchen. And then after like 30 minutes, like, 
God's got the bottle. <laughs> and then me, listen, me, I encourage you. Me, I'm just like, yeah. Yeah, do your uh, thing. Yeah, drink. Because me, I'm still drinking. Me, I was like, we're going to drink. Yeah, let's, let's get it popping. What's hey, good? That was a good day. Yeah. That was a good day. Yeah. Then Saturday is my party now. It's a day mm-hmm. thing, right? So day thing. The invitation was, your invitation said, <laughs> party begins at 10 a.m. No, we knew 10 a.m., but he said oh. 9.30 a.m. Oh, so, so that first, guys first get that to begin with, guys don't believe it. I'm like, day drinking is not a thing. Because <laughs> I've just woken up, I'm seeing Karen is there with Prince. I'm thinking, <laughs> okay, no, Do you remember how many times did Prince call us? Prince, Prince Karen is so excited. Prince, like, sure, Prince called me on Friday just to make sure that I know he's coming on Saturday. <laughs> yeah. He called me Saturday in the mornings, like I've showered, I'm just waiting for mama to get ready. You're coming. <laughs> Prince gets uh, there. Crazy thing. So we are doing shots. So because we're doing shots of alcohol and Prince is the baby. Don't put me in that conversation. We gave him shots water. of water. Bless you guys. <laughs> this hey, is Rosh, no, 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 I have a question. Yeah. Good. Did you say everybody Everybody must be here by 9.30? Or did you say party begins at 9.30? Thank you. Okay, so. Thank you, Eros. No, you, you should Thank be a lawyer. You. You should Technicalities. Be a lawyer Thank so you. If, if you're finding Find loopholes. the loopholes. <laughs> that is a necessity. Okay. So, so party begins at 9.30. The party is for me and trees. <laughs> hey, listen. No, I'm serious. Was there, that so, sounds like a was you there, problem. Was there on time? That sounds like a you problem. Because you slept in five times. Do you know? So the thing is, strictly, the only, woke me up the only times. way, no. yeah, the only way Moss is, make, is on time is if he sleeps in the house. If alarm clock. Anyway, Yo. so long story short, Former gang don't show up on time. Yeah. Everyone, everyone got penalties. I'm sure you saw that on my Instagram. Yeah. If you didn't, I'll repost again. Bro, bro, I'll repost bro. just for, for the sake of it. But Saturday, bro, such a beautiful day, bro. Beautiful. It was such nice. Such a beautiful day. Y'all made it so special. Bro. Oh. Nah, but Listen, it was so sad. Because when I walked what? in, boy, Lianza. No, so when everyone... Every, okay, not everyone. Because Charisma and Emma Cheruto. So Emma Cheruto showed up Please. when the party is ending. But anyway, so Charisma is last. But So the last guys to show up, yeah. literally get there. Uh, then it starts raining. Yeah. So now we have to it move back to the house. It was me yeah. and one who walked time. in. At, no, 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 no. no. You were there for like, we yeah. walked in and it immediately... Yeah. No. no. One no. love and I yeah. walked in at the same time they and started, immediately yeah. started it started. Oh, to, yes. It was like 30 minutes. No. no. Yeah, 30 minutes in. I feel like, I feel like a bunch it of... It was not before. even 30 minutes. I swear to God. We walked in. So you had to to God for real. Started raining. Took a bell. You see now I've ever seen someone lie. Like, lie. <laughs> this is why this is why I'm Mas, on my phone all the time. I was not even dealing with such people. Me. Nigga, I was there. <laughs> <laughs> we walked in immediately. Void the answer. I we played like move. seven songs. I didn't even drink. Raining. What do you mean? My booze wasn't even open. I had just walked in. Anyway, so huh. it's okay. You guys uh-huh. decide who came in first, and then we talk about <laughs> it. So, uh, so we move back to the house, right? That's what she said. Um, so Wanjira and I. Siongi. <laughs> 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 This is the best episode yet. You know what? This Can you is imagine? The best episode. Every Everybody recording. Pam, 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 pam. Do you know what's crazy? Every recording is our best episode yet. Yes. Uh, Fucking crazy. Anyway, so Eliamin comes up. So the party is, um, everything's happening. It's open yeah. air. We're having vibes. Eli's doing tattoos. Um, so uh, Wandi and I decided we're getting matching tattoos. Mm-hmm. So because the last trip I did, you can't mention what. So, okay. But did. you're going to show us the tattoo, though. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you know, you know. So, you were like, shit. Because it was our first time yeah. doing the trip with me. Yeah. So, you were like, getting a trip of that. So, okay. we got matching, matching shrooms. Shroom tattoos. <laughs> Dick tattoos. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine Munesh the whole night? Munesh. Walking me around, because it was like 26 of us. Yeah. Walking around everyone is like, he just got a dick on his hand. I'm like, it's not a dick. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Like, eh. it is. You also got a tattoo. I got a tattoo, man. I also I got, got a tattoo. Oh, you also got a tattoo. We all of us got, got tattoos, tattoo. I also got yeah. a tattoo. Come on. Fantastic. So anyway, I'm, so I'm super grateful. That was Bless a crazy you. party. Bless There's you. Two more to go, and then ah, I can finish my back. Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah. Ah. You're with me, number Sally, next week. So shut up. Yeah, Siko. Yeah. Yeah. There's that. Uh, so then there's then Tuesday. then there's the singer. That's, that's coming. Anyway, so two more, yeah. and then I'm done with my birthdays. So that's uh, <laughs> Saturday, right? Yeah. Uh, so we finish our uh, party. Is like I think we leave the house like at nine ten, around nine ten, right? Yeah. So we leave my house. Um, you guys go. Three to quarter meals. of the guys are going to Muse Open Air, yeah. and then the other quarter are going to Heavy K. Yeah. Uh, so crazy party, we get uh, to Eros. Eros was in the boot. <laughs> yeah, Eros was in the boot. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so uh-huh. we get to Muse. 
uh, all of us are lights. We're, we're sorting our ticketing <laughs> things so, so we can get in. Yeah. And then someone is looking, someone points at Karegi. He's like, where are your shoes? Then she's like, what the fuck? I don't have shoes. <laughs> we left my house all the way to the club. Yeah. She did not realize she didn't have shoes on. That's mad. That's how little Shout out to Karegi. Shout out to Karegi. That's how little Anyway, so that's Saturday. Sunday we wake up. Um, so we go back to my house, myself, Mas, and and, and Erosh. <laughs> Mas sleeps the whole time. Up. Actually, Mas is the reason we leave the party early because he's sleeping in the club. Okay. So we go down, we check Mas. Now, nah, but Mas. let me tell you, I even asked you guys, wow. why are you Can guys I... taking Mas? Because Mas was staggering to go wash his hands. <laughs> and I asked you, I was like, <laughs> like um, to And Mas, also. Mas couldn't even say a single word. <laughs> Do you know you couldn't ah. even make a word? <laughs> no. I, I actually made the one sentence I made. How much Cabin is the how much? <laughs> Because, you know, like, I just got to the house and I'm like, ah, it's just a cup there. Yeah. Anyway. I'm like, do not yeah. how much. I'm not, I'm not done with you. Oh. I'm not done with you. So, did now... You drink, we, now did you drink at the house? Did I drink at the house? Did we drink at the house? When you got back. We were drinking the whole time. Okay, so, I'm telling you. So, anyway, so, Master's uh-huh. sleeping. Uh, I can't see Erosh because uh, he'd, she'd left, come back. Mm-hmm. So, I'm taking Mas. Um, we are waiting for Uber outside the club. Mm. Guess who walks? Erosh. Erosh walks up his side. Even me, I'm psyched because I want to keep dancing. The music is sick as fuck. Yeah. But now, I'm just like, I have to go home. Yeah. I tell Erosh, I'm sorry, we have to it's go home. He's time. like, what the fuck? What do you mean? Anyway, so we decide we go home. Yeah. Mas sleeps all through the journey. We go home. We get home. Of course, Mas, we take Mas to bed. Mm-hmm. I'm like, I'm tired. I want to sleep. Erosh is like, Ulali. <laughs> <laughs> so Erosh is up. I'm tired. Erosh keeps me up. But a beautiful conversation for hours. Yeah. No, sleep can almost we, can, hours. can we just get some two, 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 two for so, you? Yeah, for hours. <laughs> so we sleep. Anyway, so <laughs> we end up... actually in the recording. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we yeah, end up okay. sleeping. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So we end up <laughs> sleeping <laughs> around... <laughs> so we end up sleeping around seven yeah. in the morning, right? Wow. Seven? Yeah, yeah. So Marcy slept the whole time, right? So Erosh and I end up sleeping like... At, by the time I'm sleeping, it's seven for sure. Because yeah. now, at 6.40, I tell Erosh, nigga, this is it. I'm sleeping. He's like, no. So I just go upstairs and sleep. Did you guys sleep? Did yeah, at this point, I'm, yeah, I'm just like, yeah, I'm, I'm just like, yeah. Did nah, okay, check, but, but you, did yeah. you guys sleep in the same bed? Yes. Oh. oh. But you first cuddled. Did you cuddle? Ah. You first cuddled. <laughs> ask Mas. Ask Mas. I, I ask Mas in the house. Are you gonna cuddle me? Mas is like, Z. Mas ali nanga lele ya like. No, no, no. Mas wanted to punch me. Let me the moment. I was, I was blacking out and I'm like, you're gonna cuddle me. <laughs> <laughs> it's true though. Like, there's one thing I'm sure about yeah. is that. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. um, so me I have work on Sunday. Mm-hmm. The agreement is everyone the, be there. The, yeah, yeah, you know they're coming. <laughs> so Mariah, because Mariah had to leave. The initial plan was after the club, you are gonna come back to my house. Yeah. yeah. But then you left with the cousin. Yeah. So the plan is, it's fine. When we leave my house, we yeah, call you and link up, yeah. right? Uh, 9 a.m. I'm a bit up. I don't even Wait, know what so you're you saying. I woke you up. up. Yeah, like 9 something. So I go downstairs, get water, I come back, I rush to my diagonal to bed. <laughs> she slept diagonally. But I don't wake up once, <laughs> but I just, I I, like, I didn't wake up once to get out, but I just woke him up. Like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, 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 you know what I mean? Anyway, yeah. so I rush and I get ready, we finish, I go to wake up once. Because I was like, do you wake up when you're getting ready? No. So wake up Mas. He's like, give me 10 minutes. I'm oh, like, wow. you told me to Big give me 10 mistake. minutes. When someone what? tells you give me 10 ago. minutes, don't do it. So long story short, Mas decides his sleeping is not coming with us. So Erosh no, and I no, bounce because I had work. We go work. I really? remember the exact same time because I flipped my phone over. It was like 11.37. Mm. And up, say. <laughs> we had work. <laughs> Bro, we, we had work. work. I just told Jaxi. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they need to. I'll meet you guys. <laughs> <laughs> and like, yes, so, line uh, number two. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, we go work. Yeah. It's amazing. It's a fun activation. Boom, boom, boom. Mm-hmm. Uh, we hang out. And then that's the It was really nice. Oh. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. You guys yes. got a podium today. Huh? We? Yeah. We must stop and finish number seven. Yeah, which is fine. But check, check. Yeah. Why is it so the I'm mic check one? Up. Out of all of them. Oh, no, it's fine. No. That's it's crazy. Fine. That means the episode is dropping. <laughs> <laughs> Dope oh shit! Ah, so, we haven't watched the stand up. Wait. When you come back, so I promise I'll save it. Yeah. When you come back so, from Kakuma, me I'll watch I it. Am. Yeah, I'll watch it. Too. I'll you know, have to watch it. Ah, <laughs> now I have, I have, I have to, I have to butcher a joke. I have to butcher a joke. Yeah, tell me. So we're going to checkpoint. Mm-hmm. In fact, we've been going to checkpoint for a while. Bro, so I have to joke his joke. So uh, we are recording like Sunday at night. Yo, shout out to you guys, man. This guy is. 
Honestly. You hold it down all the time. Like, this is Sunday. Shout out to the it's like now, it's 40, yeah. And you guys are here, man. Definitely. Shout out to the gang. And y'all have been here for every single episode. Do you know how crazy imagine? that is? It's you know how crazy it is when I clap by myself. It looks like I'm... <laughs> <laughs> you guys know. You know, you know why. <laughs> it sounds like I'm having sex. <laughs> I'm like... I'm over here like... I'm like... I'm tired. I'm like... You guys, we've been here the whole time. Just switch off his mic. I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs> oh! We need to clap together. That is oh, that is doggy. Yeah. Which reminds me. Sunday, 8 Hold up. PM. Hold up. Uh, so the <laughs> craziest thing happened in, in my party during the yeah. day, right? Uh, so Mas is playing music. Um, I'm just getting guys in. Say, say I'm DJing. You know when you say playing music. Okay, so Mas is DJing. Like, right? Bluetooth. So Mas is DJing. <laughs> <laughs> True. So Mas is DJing and yeah. killing it, right? But then, because everyone is coming in late, so I have to keep receiving people. Yeah. So, you know, then, then there's people sat around one table, mm. like a bunch of guys, and guess yeah. what? They're discussing checkpoints. No uh, freaking way. Our friends, it's, it's a heated Love argument it. about our last conversation on checkpoints. Yep. About, the about the front seat. The front seat of babes and, oh, and partners. Christ. So I walk in, I'm like, oh shit, I asked you, Mas, mm. Mas, put a mix, you have to join this. Yeah. Because it's heated and it's hilarious. Yep. So Musa, one of our friends, Musa, is like, Musa goes. Now Musa uh, do you know Musa, yeah. I Musa love like, him. Do you know why yeah, missionary Musa, is my yeah. favorite style? Ah. Everyone is like, no. Musa goes because I like to deliver good meals. Ah. Ah. <laughs> I'm not gonna let you do that. You've spoiled his joke. You've okay. ruined it. Yes, <laughs> okay, do it. Let do me it. do the joke. Yes, do it. Musa okay. says, yeah. do you know why I like missionary? Yeah. Because mm -hmm. I like to spread the gospel. Oh! That was, that was the punchline. No, to spread good news. Just good news. Good good news, news. Yeah. But to spread. Either way, yeah. To spread, but you know. But okay, you know, if you like the word like... spread, you've ruined the joke. <laughs> 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 yeah. like, do you know I like to be a missionary? Because yeah. I like to deliver the good news. Because I like news. to deliver the good news. <laughs> <laughs> to spread. Okay. <laughs> anyway, but then that, that wasn't even the punchline. So yeah. we think that's the punchline, right? Mm. Then what, what was the punchline? That was the punchline. <laughs> no, 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 no. You know what? The punchline. You know what? Yeah, what it was lead. You know, remember, was? it was lead, but Le remember, it was lead. Boo, 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 it was lead, boo, boo. anyway. Yeah. But then I'm just bringing this up to be like, yo, mm -hmm. crazy that our close friends yeah. are having a crazy heated discussion about checkpoints. Checkpoint. And from the latest episode. Yeah. And remember when Calvin asked yeah. on air that um, our highlight of like, our like highlight of, of all the checkpoints that we've done, no. which is the yeah. which, which is uh, the our highlight of all the episodes. Then I told him it's every it's the last every few episode, episodes yeah. because we have this new segment called checkpoints, yeah, where we discuss real issues. Yeah, yeah. there's nonsense and there's uh, yeah. Nonsense. So to see that yeah. come in light and it's our close friends yeah. and it's heated. Yeah, I thought that was really that beautiful. was everything. Yeah, shout out really to <laughs> anyway, checkpoints. Shout out to one dear. Shout out mm -mm. to one dear. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Do you know how many? Do you know how many <laughs> women? Do you know how many women in my DM kept asking about one dear, bro? Uh, really? Yeah. I love it. Did you see her? Was I in your DMs as well asking about Of course. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. Bro, who this? <laughs> <laughs> and Wandia is... No, but... Wandia is... The, remember what Wandia posted? The mm. crazy meme of the dude with crazy veins in his neck and then captioned, it, this is Chaxi <laughs> on every episode. Ask, yeah. Asking Mas about masturbation. Bro, yeah, no, but not asking Mas. Hey, well, whenever whenever Chaxi has the urge to ask Mas about masturbation. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, like when like when how you <laughs> hold yourself before you ask before him ask about, about <laughs> masturbation. <laughs> but uh, she didn't lie. So which reminds me, yeah, which, 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 was which convincing remind, me to get a weird lie. touch with Jana. Which reminds me, yeah. and I'm going to let you say this joke, because mm -hmm. it's, it's a better joke. <laughs> Friday, uh -huh. in your house, packing a fucking suitcase before we head out. Yeah. The in Kakuma. my house. In your house. Oh, Friday, uh, after, uh, after, after Alex made us go take drinks and dinner. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then in your house, yeah. the Kakuma joke. You have to say it. I'm sorry. I Fuck you. Say okay, I'll say it, it then. <laughs> <laughs> so, long story short. <laughs> it's not Mas a and, joke. So, Mas, Mas and I were talking about, Fuck, man, I haven't been laid in a while. Uh-uh. Wait, checkpoint. Do 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 checkpoint. Ah, ga 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 ga
Then he taps my shoulder. It's like, uh, fuck, man. The thing about my roster, it doesn't look like I'm even going to get there in the next week. You know why? Because uh, mass... There is Looking no at your roster, you have a roster. I have a roster. No, not of babes. Not of babes. Okay. Just a schedule. Yeah, so clarification. Schedule. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway, so let me finish. Uh, then he goes... Um, so the reason why we are recording Sunday late is because Mas yeah, is going to Kakuma, trip, yeah, tomorrow, to Kakuma very early tomorrow. Mm-hmm. He's like, fuck, I'll be in Kakuma the whole week. Nas Japata Kakuma. It's a good one, right? Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> now, nah, I'm laughing because it's corny. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I'm laughing. You'll be in Kakuma. I'm going nah, to Jap- do Nas humanitarian Kakuma. work, bro. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, checkpoint. So checkpoint yeah. this week, we're talking about the whole diary situation. This oh my terms... God. Now is when you're starting the episode. Can you yeah. imagine? 30 minutes so the... I know, this is fun. <laughs> I take an hour. Yeah. So let's I'm not wrong. Let's this stems from a conversation on Twitter from someone <laughs> called at Masi Murugi. Mm-hmm. Uh, this is on 26th of September. She says, yeah. someone wants to add me to our WhatsApp group for his diary fundraiser. Mm-hmm. We are not friends, just uh, acquaintances. Mm-hmm. How do you tell someone nicely, please get married when you can afford it? Or... Do I just leave him on blue ticks? Yeah. Uh, I'm reading Manifest Monkey's response and then we get into it, right? Mm-hmm. Contribute and ask to be part of the marriage. <laughs> be a shareholder and you will be entitled to spousal benefits. Yeah. You are, uh, your sushi man is right there, open their eyes. Okay. So the whole conversation is on. I was, because uh, I, um, I have the thing on groups. Like you, you have you, you have to get a request. Request I blocked yeah. people adding from so I got a request uh, from someone I know mm-hmm. uh, who was adding me to a wedding committee and I declined. Mm-mm. And I was like, because it's a wedding. I feel like in your wedding That's you need to have people close thing. to you. Yeah. It's intimate, right? Not, not like because yeah. I know you. What the fuck am I doing in a wedding committee? Not even close to you. Like, if it's your wedding, it's your bill. <laughs> like, that's a you problem, so, sir. Send me an That's a you invite. problem. Send me an invite. Not Simple. an invite to contribute. So, dowry contributions. Or, like, ask me for... Uh, contributions don't have to be monetary. Mm-hmm. You know, you can say, like, let's say, Chucks, if Emotional you support. If you have a nice car, <laughs> and now I'm like, yes, yeah, so baby, baby, angu. <laughs> <laughs> Wedding young, no. yeah, you know. If like you have a nice car, I'm like, but let's say you own to do, Mara, you own to do some garden somewhere. I'm like, yo, can I have my wedding at your gardens? You know. No, I'm yeah. giving you fifty percent off. <laughs> That's okay, yeah. but you know, you can't just tell someone that oh, I'm getting married soon to me twenty k. Yeah, honestly, the thing is. I like what I like what Ben is saying. Mm-hmm. Like, if you want me to contribute to your fucking wedding, then open a relationship. Like, I need to be part of it. So Come it's on. not a contribution; it's an investment. It's an Basically, investment, yeah. so like, but the thing is, yo, but I don't. I don't even think I have a problem with the wedding contributions and whatever. My issue is when it comes n- down to the wedding and the gifting. So there's mm-hmm. this one time, one of my uncles was getting remarried. Remarried. Yeah, like he. Um. Okay, it's a tragic story though. Like they were, he was so the, li- the Lua man thing is. No, 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 no. <laughs> he was living in Kenya. He oh, was living in tragic. Kenya. They just got a baby, so he got a new job in Uganda. So they went to Uganda. The wife died in four days. Mm. Yeah. Four so, days after the marriage. Like no, four days after they left Kenya. Okay. So it was like okay, so you know, single dad, da da da. Plus he has work, whatever, whatever. So he had to leave. He has to be brought back to Nairobi. So he came back. Then started dating someone else, and they had to get married. How long after? Because you remember how Maria was. But the baby the... about moving on. But you yep. see, this is a very different situation. There's a baby involved. There's a baby involved. Nah, bro. Yeah, right. Like it's not different. You know what I mean? In that situation, hey, I honestly, nah. Uh, nah. nah. Mariah. No, no, no. In that situation, but they, I was, I, I understood. Uh, but it's very weird because they just got divorced this year. There's a baby involved. Yeah, yeah there's Bro. a baby involved. He oh, just shit. needed. He just needed. Oh, shit. These motherfuckers are having sex. He just needed this lady to be a maternal figure yeah. for this baby. You understand? Uh, but then, yeah, she's just been very awful, and yeah, so they just got divorced this okay. year. Yeah. So anyway, moving forward. So when he was getting married, remarried rather. He had this thing where that's the time when Nakumat was still around. And so he sent us the you invitation. We got it. And he's that's like, good. get the gifts in Nakumat and confirm the cancelled gifts. I'm like, boss. No, but that's cool. Me, Why? Yeah. No. It's, it's, hold up. It circles back because mm-hmm. I, I forgot. I think I did the intro for Checkpoint wrongly because mm-hmm. the conversation was on dowry contributions and also on mm-hmm. you choosing what you, you want to be gifted. Yeah. Which is, I'm just saying, I'm just like, adding to you. And yeah. that's the thing. Like, imagine if I had to gift you half a spoon, 
That's what I can give to you. Uh, but no, you, you, no, you get what I mean. Why the fuck do you give even half a spoon? No, that's, no, you get what, but you get what I mean though. Even if I want like to give you, you'll, you'll break the spoon into. If a... I want to give you atta soliakiatu, that is what so, I can give you. Bonus, <laughs> no, bonus, like, why don't you have good examples? <laughs> like, what gift? Nah, are I'm, I'm going down to the worst of the worst. No, of the worst. but what, what? Okay, why are you gifting someone okay, half a spoon? Okay, if I want to give you a box, a box of glasses of wine, that's what I want to give you. Then that's the best. Okay, why is this half? Why is it not a full box? Okay, I'm just asking. What the fuck are these? I said, if I want to gift you a box of wine glasses, that's what I want to gift you. The last wedding you I You can't contain me in a box yeah. when you're telling me, mm-hmm. at the, oh, go through a list, and whatever is cancelled, don't re-gift. Like, 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 where would you? Where, where would be that? Be the first thing you you say? Half a spoon. Yeah, no, or oh, like a shoe. Worst, a shoe. If, sole. if worst yeah. comes to worst. So the second last wedding I ever went to, because yeah. the last one was Omesh Adele, mm-hmm. man who missed our gig, but because it's because um, man, she, she, lo- she, no, she lost her grandma. Her grandma. So. Yeah, I okay. saw that. Condolences. Mm-hmm. Anyway, it's like before her wedding, the wedding I went to was I was I think in from one. And then someone had known mm-hmm. and had been to their house mm-hmm. even before they got married, right? Mm-hmm. Go to the wedding, the gifting area, bro. There's like a TV stand. There's like a microwave. Bro, they have mm-hmm. a nice TV stand already. They have a microwave. So the whole thing I'm thinking, <laughs> so where the fuck are they going to take another TV stand and microwave? Are you going to sell it? OLX.com. <laughs> so my thing about gifting is, yeah. you leave gifting open and guys are going to gift you things you don't, either you don't need Mm. Or um uh, or things you don't have use for. Yeah, I'm not against gift me what you genuinely want to, but I'm just saying when it comes sometimes it's fine to be like, don't give me house appliances, yeah. don't give me whatever. So the couple, the the the, the example we're giving is a couple that said they just want cash as gifts. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like if you wanna gift me, they're not saying you have to gift me, but if you wanna gift me, too much whatever too you much would much have bought, her, just, send, just the send the money because. It Bro, what the fuck am I buying Mangia TV for? As and a then gift? imagine if, like, it's Mariah's wedding, you buy a microwave, I buy a microwave. Now they exactly. have two microwaves. Now you have two yeah, microwaves. I'll be, I'll be snowballing. Three, 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 three because they already, microwave, they already, they already have the microwave at home. <laughs> <laughs> snowballing which, which is in this beach. The last one. Please. <laughs> Oh, like, I can put coffee, I can put cinema, I can put... Please! The, bring them all! Qu- question, Ernest. Where the fuck do you guys have I'm two microwaves? I'm so bullying in this bitch. What Why do you all have two microwaves in this studio? Three. Yeah, yeah. No, this, three. It's three. three. It's three. Where the three fuck do you have three microwaves? Okay, well, I, know, I know one is yours. I might, Denise. One is yours. Why do you have like, a microwave? Your microwave is in the studio. You don't need it in your house. No, you have to get the mic. Now, li- pause, pause. You have to get the mic. Get the mic. Yo, so this dude... You, when you need to eat, you have to come to the studio. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? I know you I'm love music. You I know you love music and being in this studio. But what the fuck would you need to always come here to eat? <laughs> nah, I returned it. It's at home. It's okay, at home. Why, so right now we have two other? microwaves. Yeah, so why was it here in the first place? Uh, I needed to fix it over here. It had an okay. issue, yeah. Okay. So I, I, feel it, like, yeah. I feel like with a plan, nah, nah, nah. if you need to fix them, just throw them away. Facts. It was just Ukisha a power thing. Well, it's then, yeah. done. Yeah. Just get a new one. The nice Asian people. It, it was a together. power thing. <laughs> okay, okay. Just replacing the plug. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Let me yeah. tell you, the, the last wedding I went to, mm. um, there was a till number. Instead of a gifting station. Yeah. Okay, there was a gifting station. Yeah. Of course, because of, I think it was a go when I come on to now. Yeah, the, whatever our, they want to now, bring. now, like, there was a till number. Like, within the tent, up what to do. It's like, send money here. I was like... The, that's how it's supposed to be. Yeah. It's shampoo. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. This motherfucker is Kikuyu, man. So English, is, English is like your tenth language or something. Yeah, man. And you're killing it. Yeah, I'm killing it. Literally. Imagine. I speak fluently, right? Email. Yeah. Anyway, as you shema. Eh? As I shema. <laughs> but I think that's that's how it's supposed to be. Yeah. Hey. It's... I agree. Also... But you're not Because also... Chiki, I'll buy your microphone for... 10k. I'm a, how much are my crews? Mm-hmm. Let's say 10k. AGs, 10, 8, 10. It's been part of 2, 8k. It's true though. And so, also, ah yeah, Niku gift microwave you pass to Kekesho. Would you be grateful that there's a new microwave? Ah, uh, Mariah, you're thinking. Uh, like, how would you even think like well, that? Are you, are nah, you I'm, I'm just trying to drag it. Like, then, I get what you mean. You know, you are yeah. the, you're no. the Karegi of this episode. Shout out Karegi. But, oh my God. Imagine, imagine, imagine. I'm like, offended, but I'm happy at the same time. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, they like, have to be happy. Just you have like, to respect, bro. Yep. Yo, man, honestly, you shout have out to, to Karigi, babes. 
The way you are moving on Saturday, no. I'm so proud. <laughs> I am so proud. Oh God. But yeah, I, I'm going to forget about what I'm saying. But I was saying, like, so, but you're not too close. Yeah, I yeah. agree. Is it so, so we are all for? Yeah, yeah. It's fine to decide. No, what I feel like right now with these times, because yeah. the money, I feel like there, there was this, oh, there was this thing where you know, like you had to bring a physical. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Whether with the times, I'm like, okay, yeah, I can, I can yeah. give you. Because also, be, generally speaking, right? Yeah. yeah. You probably have everything you feel you Facts. need for like your house, because most people yeah. do stuff for the house. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. So I'm like, um, please, but also. When it comes, so was your biggest issue just the fact that they were like specifically yeah. money? No, 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 no. Me, my issue for my uncle's wedding was the fact that it was like you have to strictly go to Nakumat and to do it, you have to confirm. That's a person. The... That's a person who knows what they want. Exactly. Hey. No. So you can't say no. this is the problem. So if I have a wedding and I'm telling you, I am not talking about TV. Buy me this TV. <laughs> What's the problem with that? I see. Okay, so. So now if you bring so, me a TV that I don't like. Like, boss, I'm I'm just trying to do something nice for you. You you cannot put you can't. No, you can't. You can't so is the all is the problem. That's like the that's like if a babe telling you, you need to me a fair, okay. When you need how much for 50? No, so yeah, I want 3,000. So that's not the same. It's the same, same fucking thing. thing. Let's Hold just up. agree that Maria doesn't know how to make analogies. Yeah. <laughs> Completely. It's um, to, the same um, to a half a spoon. Uh, at okay, half so, a spoon. Yeah. Uh, so let me flip. Half, <laughs> is it like this way or like... I know. So are you having the... Size. Yeah, what happens? <laughs> so let me flip this around. Mm-hmm. Slowly, because I feel like the money conversation is always said. a sensitive conversation. Facts. Right? So you'd buy me a, something worth... Uh-huh. Uh, 20k, right? Mm-hmm. But then, because I don't necessarily know what the price point is, mm-hmm. is that easier than you sending me 20k? Because maybe you'd feel like is 20k too cheap, or you know what I mean? Is it just because the money conversation is a weird conversation? It's just like salaries. I, my colleagues, I, like, because me, I talk about my salary openly, and my colleagues yeah. are surprised because, yeah, because, like, <laughs> no, like, yeah, like, it's supposed to be such a secretive it, thing. Yeah. And I'm like, it's just money, it's supposed to be thing. an open yeah. conversation. You know what I mean? How much? 20k? 20, no, 15. 15. 15. Huh? <laughs> 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 Watch any and then you're going to share a chat. <laughs> so, do you think genuinely it's because there's so much value mm. that goes into actual money? So, a specific price point of money, like, I'd rather buy you. A MacBook, because that give you eighty five. Maybe I even got it for. Yeah. I, I I think so. And it's some value. I think yeah. so. It's like gifting you for a birthday. I'm like, <sighs> maybe there are people shoes. who have the, the people who I do love shoes. The people who have wish wish lists. Mm. Even on Amazon, you can create a wish list, mm. and then someone can come and clear it. That's why that's a love language. No, I know, because what yeah, my cousin <laughs> had that. Uh-huh. It was like I need, I want like for my birthday, I'd love to get this. Is that, that, that. Yeah, and I was like, yeah, 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 that's okay. I've seen it. I don't, I don't. Yeah. That's a, and I'm saying I don't have a problem with having a wish list, but my issue is when you're so on that wish list, you get oh, what I mean. Specific. I know what I want. And so no, it's, it's like saying have... I want yellow canvases. I love like mm, I'll buy you black ones. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, you want yellow canvases. Mm-hmm. Cool. But you can't tell me you want your local canvases the with green laces, juicy, juicy, no. I can't. But he's talking about shoes, not not a canvas, but converse. Canvases. <laughs> so <laughs> it's just small shit. It's fine. Mara is the head of them. Of them all. Anyway, um, personally, because we have such beautiful people who listen and tune into the show, I have a wish list. If you're not clear, mm. please. My DM is <laughs> open. Yeah, and that guy, Chucky. Just leave it alone. No, but Chucky, you, I'm definitely... What do you think would be my wish list? I'm getting you glasses. I'm getting you glasses. No, Chucky sure. has mad glasses in his house. No, nope. she's never seen. I have crazy... I have you know, I've, 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 I, today, so yeah. you left me in your house. Yeah. 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 I woke up. Yeah. And then at like, let's, let's say like, like, like a what? Maybe noon. No, you woke up at 2 p.m. You woke up at 2. Uh, you 2 p.m. Me. is when I called you guys back. No, you, you woke up at 2.32. Yeah. Mara, I have a, a crazy set. On record. Bro. But because we drink a lot. It's just easy to what I was looking for. I was looking for oil. Because <laughs> I wanted to make eggs. Yeah. I found the eggs. The only two eggs left. You I'm made sorry, five eggs them. just before you slept last yeah. night. Yeah. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, with the... Remember that. <laughs> so there are two eggs left. Yeah. And then I was like, let me make some eggs and some sausages. That I was looking for oil. And then I fungo every every cabinet glasses. Glasses. No yeah. way. Glasses. And yeah. Mariah would comfortably come here and talk about it. And they're like, even champagne. Yeah. Why yeah, do you have, cham- me why do you have champagne? Me too. I see those flutes? glasses. I'm gifting when you. When was the last time you, you, the last time you had champagne? There's a, there's, a babe, there's a babe I used to see who really <laughs> likes champagne. Oh, really? Because it's a babe. Yeah. Champagne flutes, bro. In your house. Yeah. 
Bro, I, I, like see them. I keep telling you I have expensive taste. And yeah. that's my biggest problem because my pocket can't match my taste. <laughs> till I see so, them. Bring champagne, I'll show no, you. No, till I see them. She bring doesn't champagne. go to champagne. Anyway, I don't my glass anyway that's done. Yeah. Something that I find most exciting, but I have to give this guy props. Edgar Barre. Yeah. Honestly. We spoke hey. about how Edgar Barre... He's changed the face Obale. of... Hey! Edgar Barre. <laughs> Edgar, man. I'm sorry I butchered your name. Edgar Barre. We yeah. spoke about just the evolution of Edgar Barre from yeah. when he started and how he's... Like, I think he's very... He, he schemes a lot and he's very tactical in yeah. how he moves, right? So now there's BNN sex, which I'd like you to expand on. Oh, so basically, it's um like... Let's say, think about OnlyFans, mm -hmm. but a Kenyan version. So you have to subscribe. You have to pay, is it, is it 49? Either 49 or 99 shillings. For sex. No, 49 or 99 dollars. Or is it shillings? It's triple nine shillings, yeah. It is a thousand. I'm, I'm already subscribed. Sure. I wear well. <laughs> I'm it's not, it's not even up and running, but you're already subscribed. <laughs> Guys, Anywho, guys, let's so be honest, yeah, it's right? basically yeah. just for sex, like purely sexual content, but it's Kenyan yeah. sex content. Bruh, because when you spoke about when Edgar Barre moved to uh, Telegram, mm -hmm. it was premium. Mm -hmm. No, I mean subscription based. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not on Telegram, but also I'm not subscribing for gossip. Fast. So I didn't do it. But I'd, I've always wanted to see how I can support Edgar. Yeah. You know, and I've reached out by DM even before when he was having trouble, just mm -hmm. to show support. You know what yeah. I mean? I'm subscribing to the BNN sex. Clap for me, guys. Rah! I'm sure you'd Kuna subscribe. Kuna cricket up or no, no, cricket no, 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 no. Cricket I'm, I'm sure you'd subscribe I mean, no, 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 to it, even if it wasn't Edgar. It's just a but, but I'm, 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 I've never, ever actually me, I'm spent just money Magoha. on... Yeah. I've never spent money on... on, me on I've never, but then there's a page called Butiwaden. Have you guys checked it on, on Twitter? It looked to me. I'm I never put you on. I will to me like you can share subscribe. Uh, oh my gosh. So think about mm. your I think about most of the things Edgar does. And this is just more of what how Edgar has been able mm. to just do what Edgar does. Because yeah. the thing about Instagram is he noticed because nowadays you can report pages and flag yeah. down yeah. things. So Edgar, a lot of people didn't like Edgar because he ran stories openly about people. Yeah. And it's normal. So when he kept losing his Instagram and whatnot, Edgar, I was like, shit. So what's going to happen to Edgar next? Because mm -hmm. now he didn't use IG. Guess what? Yeah. Telegram comes up. Yep. Yeah. And then he opens a subscription. So now you get free tea. And then yep. you can also subscribe for premium. Yeah. And we ran the numbers in yeah, the millions, crazy. right? Yeah. Crazy. So that's running. And I'm like, Edgar, like now BNN sex is going to drop if he's successful, depending on then the yeah. something that's yeah. coming. BNN sex. Yeah. Yeah. So okay. I'm, I'm like, okay, what's next? So I see BNN sex. I'm like, do you know how crazy this is? Because you've seen what OnlyFans does. You've seen yeah. the numbers. Yeah. So for I Edgar have to like get into it, for subscriptions, <laughs> <It's insane. laughs> for Edgar to get into it, uh -huh. and in a country like Kenya, and make it public, yeah. honestly, but then it's just because he's now on a platform that is not owned in Kenya. Yeah. So even if you shut it down in Kenya, it's we talked about it with VPNs else. and everything. Yeah. So shout out to Edgar, man. Yeah. I like to see this. Bro. Are I like you subscribing? To see this. So we, of course, <laughs> man. We we try yes. spending a thousand shillings every month to watch Kenyan sex. Of course. So yuck. Why what? Are you Mariah, you're such a hater. How are you hating on sex? <laughs> have you seen have you, have you seen have you seen Kenyan porn ever? Why or would Kenyan they why, why would they want to do but that? Do you watch porn though? No. You don't have sex. You don't watch porn. Listen, you, you, I feel you've like never I, spoken I, about honestly do, do do this. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I feel like porn really, especially for men, I feel like it really taints how you guys view sex. And to be very yes, okay. Hey, Rosh, don't give me that face. Because I'm a man now, you have to explain what you mean. No, 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 no. Like I'll, I'll be very honest with you. I would say three quarter of the men who I know love to watch porn and whatever and whatever. When it comes down to the ground, farm, you're you're literally on zero, and I'm like, you watch porn every day. So three quarter. Of, three quarters. Give me a number. Oh yes. Uh, is this a, a scientific them, number? I'm telling you, three quarter of the men who I know, like two, like, like are two. into. You know, That's like, like two oh, men. Three quarter of two men. No, no, no. Four men he knows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three of them. <laughs> Three quarter of the men who I know that watch porn yeah. on the ground, mm -hmm. zero delivery, zero knowledge. How when, when did you know? When, did, when did you do this study? <laughs> when did you do this study with? Okay, how do you know? I'm listen. No, girls, we sit and we have know? conversations with who? Uh, Friends, random people. These uh, okay. are conversations yeah, that we have. Kiss and tell, right? Listen, but girls. Listen. We're girls, I mean. I forgot girls, and, no, and girls not kiss and, and tell. Not kiss and tell to they everyone. They don't kiss and tell, they tell everything. Bro. Exactly. 
Umsele like. nda waxing lakini akona nyole tatu kwa pole. Say. No, but it's true though. <laughs> you know how guys always like, men, hey, you, did you hit that? Men will that. watch porn End of conversation. day in, day out. Yeah. But even on a drawing, locate the clit. You have no idea Aye. where this thing is. Bro, but we, can lo- but we can locate alchemists. What the fuck do you mean, bro? <laughs> <laughs> See, even me, I watch Avengers all the time. Do I have a talk? Do I, do I have superpowers? Please. <laughs> Zero delivery as in... Porn, no. I feel like porn really just stains everything of what sex is supposed to be. So altogether, course, okay. I do I do not engage, okay. and I will definitely not be engaging in BNN sex. I'm putting it out there. So at least you're on BNN. The other for, for I I, so, I unsubscribed. I'm not even on that shit anymore. She, boring. She boo. Hates, what do you love, man? No, because honestly, the basic was boring. I won't lie, okay. and I'm not about to subscribe to content here. Ambare ati alikunya chai sangapi. Miss me with that shit. Anyway, so, so Mas and yeah. I, Mas and I, so are you still on Bumble, by the way? Yeah, I'm still on Bumble. You're still on Bumble. Yeah. So I I got tired, man. So Mas and I will update you guys on BNN sex. Perfect. Uh Chaxi will update you guys. <laughs> 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 you know, it's just like, don't fucking bundle me up together no, with but all this shit. At the end of the day, if that's where you're getting your coin, only fans, yeah. thingy, yeah. do what you have to do. Yeah. But on no, this side of town, honestly, I'm curious. Nah. Would you date a sex worker? Would I date, of course. What? Would you date a porn star? Of course. Yeah. What? This can is you see you're asking. Bro, you're asking me if I can date someone who can fuck me properly. <laughs> I'm who also asking you. Hey, no, 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 no. What? Imagine, imagine in the morning they're like, babe, have a good day at work. You too. I'm in the na Johnny scenes. Bro. I'm in the good in your Skia. Me, me. Skia. Bro. Me na kuambia. Yo, genuinely, as a dude, I'm gonna ask you this. Yeah. As a dude. Has a, have you ever been with a babe who fucked your brains out? I, I know you're about to take us to another point. Oh. Next, no, I'm sorry. Ah, Jackson, we know you. Car- for the Next, we'll be in Moses' boxers. Next oh. topic. <laughs> I'm not ready. <laughs> I'm not no, ready. No, 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 no. I don't want to be in Moses' boxers. No, but you know what I mean? Next. Yo, you've been with a girl who fucks your brains out. And you're telling me, you you're asking me if just, I can do a porn star. Yeah, just, you see, they make it. Yeah, thank you. Next. Next. But, anyway, but so I'll imagine be, yeah. at the babe house work today, eh? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it was like it's crazy. Um, <laughs> we, we, we were shooting, we were shooting a scene. Eleven was a, what was the scene called? Nine inch monster. Eleven, I come here like um. We only when we had to do like seven scenes. <laughs> <laughs> seven takes. I'm tired. Uh, please, <laughs> please, please massage my back so I can sleep. <laughs> <laughs> like Leo, <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! But genuinely speaking, <coughs> like, I really want to have sex with the panster. Taxi, Shafazali next. That you can put that on your wish list. Yeah, next stop. No, 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 no. If you want to clear my wish list, <laughs> if you want to clear my next, wish list, please next, next. All those shorties, all those women I see on Buriwaden. Next. Queen Tasha. So the next one is related to the same conversation, yeah. right? Mm-hmm. So Vibes Cartel just got engaged and you know he's in prison. Bro, you know how those conjugal visits are That's madness, fam. <laughs> let me ask you, let me ask, how do you get engaged in prison? Yeah, how do I, you propose? I was <laughs> reading the story and I was like, this is absolutely insane. Mm-hmm. So apparently, um, the first time, like, of course, they, this chick knew about him, mm-hmm. but of course, he didn't really know about her. So she's a she was a social worker in London, then moved to Jamaica, mm-hmm. but they were doing, you know, like the she calls. moved to Jamaica when he was already in prison. Is it? Okay, he's been inside. They just literally, like, they just like they saw each other face to face for the first time when she moved Why to Jamaica. Jamaica. Why would you get engaged to a convict? So what's, were, the, what's the future there? You understand? Someone's having life. Bro, bro. <laughs> listen, listen. It's a, this, it's a, I want to spend yo, the rest of my life with as you. As much as it's like, like you can't even spend the rest of your life with yourself. <laughs> <laughs> bro, but as much as it's a convict, uh-huh. it's fucking vibes cartel, bro. No. People get married to nah, an idea. Bitch. People, nah. but, yo, I get people it. People fall in love with ideas. Boss, but yo, hey. be honest, vibes cartel. There's no way it's not packing. There's no way. Nah, bro. Vibes cartel gives big dick energy. Come on. Fuck. Yo. Come on, mm. nah, there's no way. Bro, it's f- uh, are you guys serious? <sighs> Me, my only question mm. is like, did he bleach everywhere? <laughs> <laughs> Cake soap, <Hilarious>. maybe, maybe, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe. No, nah, but it's you understand, like it's insane. So they had mm-hmm. never seen each other. Yeah. It was just, you know. Never seen each other. Never. 
but till she moved to Jamaica. That's crazy. So she gets there, so they're doing all these calls, and you know, like we're doing the call, da, 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 and that's when Ati he finally proposed, like after yeah, yeah a, a minute. So now he's engaged. Can you imagine? Yeah. Can you imagine? The conversations are happening while he was in prison. Like, yeah. Like mm. she just moved bro, to Jamaica. Bakata, bro, 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 Bakata has been, he's been Women, vibes. Bro. Katella Inside has been releasing like, music. Mark, I'm like, yeah, releasing music is nice. Yeah, but I'm just like, is he in like a Pablo prison? Like, I would like to know what kind no, of maybe. prison vibes is in, bro. But I mean, no, it's the same with even American rappers. But also, like, he's like high profile, somebody. so he's accorded some, yeah, some, some rights. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, but I'm like, can you imagine? So I read this some somewhere. Mm -hmm. It said, I don't remember where, maybe someone, but someone on the internet, right? It said, mm -hmm. like, dudes, we come faster if it's someone you really like the first time you have sex with them. Okay. Can you imagine all this happening? I know for sure because Vibe has been in prison. Maybe he gets conjugal rights and everything, but I yeah. know, I know Mkonozaki is going to squam them, but he's ah. been not working. He's not working. There's no way. <laughs> nah, okay. keep going. So, me, yeah, I'm waiting for the punchline. Yeah. Oh, there's no punchline. There's no there's punchline. No, it's just a build up. It. It's just a build up to whatever we're discussing, okay. right? Okay. Because, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. This is happening now. Yeah. Actually, so the first know. time... <laughs> I actually don't know what you mean. <laughs> so she vibes and this, and this babe. Uh -huh. So this is happening. And the first time now, there's... Well, how does conjugal rights work in prison? See, you guys have to, like, book a date. Then, yeah. Like, so you have, like, so you're a number of times. It depends yeah. on the kind of prisoner that you are, okay. by the way. Yeah. So come on, when you walewa umefungiwa block D, walewa kufungwa machines and whatever, block whatever. Block D nakaya was on my pack. Like, you know, you're in chains. Block D. All niggas packing. You're chained, you're, you're chained, you're <laughs> gagged. <laughs> They're like, that's a good joke. <laughs> <laughs> Officially. They're like, no. so yeah. They're like, the, like, how many inches... Uh, block it. So block it. <laughs> don't, don't, ruin the don't ruin the joke. Don't ruin the joke. No. And then, so in. block D. Can you imagine their uniforms? You can add the number of their no, blocks. But, you know, like no, in but it and depends. And then even in block D is just fear. They're it, like, hey, get those it, niggas from block D. It they depends on it. how sugo you are as <laughs> a criminal. <laughs> Can we so, end the episode here? <laughs> like, while our life, like super life imprisonment, you yeah. know, death sentence, nini ni, ni, ni. <laughs> Those uh, ones, conjugal visits, yeah. the cop has to be there. Like, yeah, he's watching <laughs> Because they you. could kill them. You understand, like, when there's a hippo, there's a womb, say, like, the cop so has the cop to be watches. there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the cop is there watching <laughs> you. That's crazy. Imagine, so, imagine while if, you give, if you give your honest work, <laughs> yeah, and there's the a cop, cop is watching, watching yeah. The cop is like, I'm just going to come. Oh, you're done. <laughs> yeah, so while I work in a second... That's the second first visit. What second degree, first degree, <laughs> petty, cop, petty yeah. crimes. Oh, yeah. uh, at least the cop can his mama outside. <laughs> Imagine when you're in prison, you don't have sex a lot. Okay, you don't depends have on a who lot you of... are. <laughs> you yeah. don't have a lot of sex yeah. outside yourself. Uh, <laughs> who told so, you that? Let's go on a dim. Uh, uh, bro, on a struck. And this way, so this, but they also no, you have to get the mic. Get the mic. So you're saying the cops do not wait for the guys to come out. <laughs> <laughs> Me hate y'all. <laughs> no, but honestly, that's that's how it works. So, but man, hey. how the fuck do you know all this information? Foxy, have you, you have wait. you accorded conjugal rights? No, no, before? no. But I've watched Netflix documentaries inside the world's okay, toughest prison. Okay, women watch this shit. All the time. <laughs> yeah. You haven't watched inside the world's toughest prison. What the fuck is that? Uh, it's an, it's and there's, and there's, crazy, there's, yeah. there's like crazy porn in that. Like, no, he didn't have porn. porn. But this okay, it's a this guy. He was incarcerated for South 15 Africa, years. South Africa. Yes, mm -hmm. but no, episode. he's a Londoner. No, 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 he's mm -hmm. a Londoner. Mm -hmm. But he was incarcerated for 15 years for some, for a crime that he did not commit. Mm -hmm. So when he was exonerated, he started yeah. going around the world showing the world's toughest it's prisons. Like a documentary, yeah. Yeah, it's but at, now in results. every like he goes to Af everywhere in the world, mm -hmm. but tough, the toughest, toughest prisons, mm -hmm. yeah. And it's crazy because there's when he visited the prison in South Africa. Yeah, yeah. that was guy, sad. That the one was, who told, the one who joked. Was, okay, he planked he him, crazy. but he was he was like, yeah, you're my you're my babe. And then he's like, you're my babe. I, I want to marry you. And then it's like, you're, you're my you babe. He wanted to no, cry. Uh, yeah, he yeah, legit like, wanted to cry. I want to have sex with you. Ati, what if I said I have no? HIV? Kwanza Ujwe is me and you. Yeah, go to the next person. He was so scared, but yeah, of course they laughed at him. They're like, yeah, it's a prank in me, but he was like, yeah, he has HIV, like it's it's a mad thing in this yeah. prison because this one, this one is his girlfriend, this one is the girlfriend. Yeah, like it's a it's a real thing. 
It's a real thing. Fuck, but I would never survive in prison. I'm telling I you. Would never go to prison. Inside the world's toughest prison, listen, you should watch that thing. You, you, That's on Netflix. <laughs> yeah, it's mind blowing. Yes, YouTube. Like, for, uh, no. Netflix. But also, like, five we have seasons. Ah, uh, uh, the thing. Uh, you know the what I mean? Uh, yeah, it's mind blowing. Whatever it is, we'll find it. <laughs> if, it's it's if it's out there, we'll find it. If it's recorded, it's there. Yo, <laughs> yo I thought, <laughs> you know, I thought like initially, mm-hmm. earlier, earlier, earlier on, maybe 2014, mm-hmm. where I was on my crazy bootleg. You know, bootlegging everything. Mm-hmm. Until. Masa's this new thing, bro. Cinema home. No, what is it called? My cinema home. My cinema home, yeah. Oh, that's you it. didn't send me the link. I'll send you. We'll send enjoy you. Enjoy yourself. Don't worry. Come on, has everything. I'm just like, how the fuck? <laughs> There's even mic check on it. Okay, nice. <laughs> of course, there should be. <laughs> there should be, bro. Like, it's such anything, it just pops up. Boom. Yeah. But talking about prisons and, you know, criminals. Yeah, uh, so Vibes Catel is engaged. Talking about it. Oh, oh Vibes Catel. Okay. Yeah, so yeah, he's engaged now. I mean, okay, next. The music is about to be late. You know, like, ah, let me tell you, me, I was a fan of Vibes Cartel until I heard what the fuck this yeah, motherfucker did. Yeah, the things did. he was up to. Mm-hmm. This guy had a dead body in his house for such how long? It happens. Like, you, you're like, you're like, coloring, bro, coloring. Oh, shit, when is him back? Yeah, forget you, baby. <laughs> yeah, well, so ma- no, gonna, s- somebody <laughs> chilling in your crib, dead. A dead person. Bro. This madness. This killed this people, stashed bunch their of bodies. People, yeah. yeah. So okay. child, let's go down. Reminds me. And then you're like, yes, will you marry me? Yes. Yeah. Imagine going to tell your dad. That he vibes. Yeah. Is um, I'm engaged. Your dad's like, Woo-hoo, who's the guy? Vibes. He's in prison. <laughs> Adija <job>. Palma. <laughs> Who? Vibes cartel. What is this having? Um, multiple crimes. But <laughs> Life <murder>. sentence. <laughs> Close to death. Yeah. It's madness. Nah. Reminds me of Jeffrey Dahmer. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The new Netflix special that ever. No, the mini documentary that ever talked about. Uh, so I saw it in passing because we in the crib. Rogo, remember? So with Erosh King in the crib, mm-hmm. it was so weird because you know the, it begins the end. Okay, not just to spend like it, how he was arrested. Watch it, right? yeah. yeah, but I, I just want to get a th- yeah, thoughts on that. <laughs> what do you guys think about it? So I was I woke up today. That's that's what I was watching this morning. So I I'm like four episodes in. Mm-hmm. You know, you know these shows that are intriguing but not intriguing. Yeah, what what is next is intriguing. Yeah, who is this sick? Mm. Yeah, it's intriguing. Yeah. Like it's shocking, intriguing. And then the weirdest thing happened when we were watching it. So we're at the kitchen, a spoon just fell. See, Jawesh took evil in my life. <laughs> Did it break in half? Is this why you have a spoon? Ah, <laughs> you're so funny, Chaxi. I'm sorry. But yeah, not... as in the spoon now, all, just fell. All jokes don't have to be a 10. Some jokes are, it's fine to be a 5. Mm-mm. 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 I'm fine with a 5. Mm-mm. It applies to sex. Yeah, Mm-mm. exactly. Right? Yeah. But Most yeah, as in, but then that, that series is disturbing. <laughs> and I've been seeing on um thingy, Twitter, um guys talking about that apparently some of the family members have been against this documentary yep. being released. Mm. And it's like Netflix is just like, screw y'all. We finna post no, it. No, Netflix didn't say screw y'all. This is serious, man. You know but what you I mean? Know, yeah, okay, they're in the public domain. But it, it again, it begs the question, what's the fine line between... Morality. You understand? Because, you know, like some of the scenes were like so graphic. As in, they are so yeah. graphic. To an extent, Baka, you're like even you as a director. Yani, you just sat and yeah, you were like yeah. And then you know, like Keep some, That's why it's a documentary. It's best. Hey, imagine some things, that things don't need yeah. documentaries. It's crazy. But man, I, I never, I never thought about it until I saw the tweet of someone saying, um, "My family was one of the victims involved in this, whatever." And there was like a next to next scenario of guys in court back in 1992. Yeah, of the, the, the sister the, the, the of the victim yeah. in court. It's, no, even on it, it's very traumatic. Even to watch on it. TikTok, there has been there's a new page that's just been created uh-huh. of guys who are victims, but they managed to help her. Yeah. And you know, even like witnesses who like said he had some guys to run away. Yeah. And it's why well, it's whether it's disturbing and I'm I'm on episode four and I don't think I'm going to finish it. Those four episodes are already traumatic enough. Who mm-hmm. to like and then okay, let's okay for the guys I've been watching, like this guy, like he was doing like really weird jobs. Yeah. First of all, he didn't finish, he didn't graduate yeah, from but, high school. But don't spoil it too much. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm just gonna give like bits, bits. So he went to the dad managed to get him into campus, but on some scientist stuff. Akafkuza mm-hmm. Shule, because he wasn't going to class. Then he got to the army. In the army, he was dragging fellow army guys and sleeping with them. Mm-hmm. So Akafkuzoka so army. Raping them. Basically, yeah. Akafkuzoka army. And the jobs that he always tried to get me jobs that include him touching blood, Nini. Like they're all just bloody nyama. You know, like it just includes a lot of intrusive, bloody stuff. And yeah, like you as in his 
honestly, he's he's just sick. Cause so, so it's not it's not a series yeah. that you can watch and you know afterwards and you're like, eh, hey, okay, that was, it's like any yani you just finish watching and you're like, what the hell did I just yeah, watch? I think maybe my opinion may probably is biased because I'm like, mm -hmm. I'm a producer in the making for for stories, you know. Mm -hmm. So my opinion could be biased, but then I feel like so much shit happens in this world. Chaxi, let me ask you a question. So right now, ask me two. Questions. No. I just want to ask you one. So right now they want to make um um a documentary like the people want to no. You decide you want to make a documentary about Onyancha. Yeah. Do you think that's something that even in your like in your morality yeah. is that something that you'd want to actually be a part of? Yeah, of course. Really? Yeah, and this is this this is what I was trying to explain earlier. Mm -hmm. Um, from a storytelling perspective, mm -hmm. and also just for information, so much shit happens. Yeah. And the thing is, the more information we put out for people, the more we help more people. Because until you watched it, or until you watched some of the crazy documentary you've seen, it's very easy to be gullible or to assume things. Because mm -hmm. generally, if you're a, a nice person as you guys are, it's very easy to assume everyone is nice. Mm -hmm. So the reason why it's essential for these stories to go out is because be young, wild, and free. Mm -hmm. Do whatever you need to do. Do the parties and whatever we do. But at the end of the day, also, um, just, just so you're living you know, in a when, world that's when, full of craziness. Yeah, when when you start feeling there's like those two things you're questioning, like this is a bit weird. Mm. Sometimes it's fine to either tell someone or walk out of that situation. Now, such documentaries are very essential because this world is super fucked up, and it's very important for guys to know. That we, you know, hear you hear all these crazy things, yep. and sometimes because they're not close, close to home, yeah. you assume it's very we'll record the podcast. Yeah, we will enjoy. We we'll go home, move on tomorrow. Things happen, and then it's just life. It's kawaii. Yeah. It's the grind every single day. Yeah. This is real life. There's True. people out here doing who really fucked up, commit things. passionate crimes, True. and most of passion crime things are crazy as fuck and as wild. Yeah. So we have to tell these stories. I feel like. The the thing is, I get it can be intrusive because maybe as yeah. a family you don't want this coming out. Yeah. But then, when are we also going to accept that there's reality of life and all of us will never agree on how bad things affect us? True. So, this happened. We're supposed to just forget it never happened. And no not one, even no, tell no, the world no this one, happened. No one is saying, like, let's just bury it. No one is saying forget. Don't get me wrong. I'm, no one is saying forget. <laughs> but... To what extent? Because remember, at the end of the day, in as much as these things happened, mm -hmm. there are families, there are loved ones who are who live this pain every day. True. And I empathize with them. Mm -hmm. But I'm just saying, it does not say the fact that they live with this pain does not take away from the fact that these things happened. And it's fine to be like, yo, this happened and it's fucked up. So we're supposed to be like, this happened, Chinyamaji. Hmm. Russia, something to say. Um, um, I, I think I don't, I don't know if this makes sense, but do, 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 you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah. So, I think, I think what I'm trying to ask is, is like, don't you feel there's, there's better stories? Because sometimes you see. The way the story was told, it was Eros, sort of. Only, can you just get a tururu for Eros, please? The, oh. the thing that he presses. When it's done. Two, number one and number ah, three. Can we tell this? It's called an NPC. 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 Even Google what an NPC. Is. Yeah, no. I think I think I think what I'm saying is, um, the guy clearly liked liked the attention. So what you, I remember like I watched the series. So the time he gets a letter and and he's like the he's like he has fans, you know. He was in prison. He was bragging, and 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 then the, and then he says, "Uh, my fans like it." So clearly, he was doing it, and he was enjoying. He was deriving joy from the attention he was getting yeah. from doing those terrible things that he did. Do you feel like his story was is is of a all the of all the stories that could have been told? You get that's the story that the, that got net, net, that could, that get all those money. You see, to you see the problem. I think with the, the, you. the problem with how you're framing this is like. You're almost saying like there's no other stories that are being told. Yeah. So, net, do you know how many documents no, are not? It's, it's there's stories for everything. So I'm why saying, why not this I'm one? I'm saying I, I'm saying you know stories, stories have heroes, right? No, not all stories. 
most Bro, it's not always about it has heroes and yeah. it has heroes and and, and villains. Okay, yeah. The way our start is, is created is everyone we see or everyone whose face you are familiar with, you, you, you don't always associate them with bad things. True. So this guy clearly wanted attention. He wanted to, he wanted to make a mark, but in the you wrong way. You think this guy was killing people because he wanted attention? No, but he... But, 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 but why are we... Why is that? Is is it that it's his it's his it's his story that that lives on? It's not the, his victims, you know, story, like yeah, like he killed people. Th- those are the stories. Okay. He should he. Wh- why are we making a documentary about him? him? We're making a doc- documentary about him because the story is about him. It's yeah, a documentary. I, it's not a movie. It's not a false story. It's a document, like, yeah. it's real. Bro, these are real life issues and we have to address. Bruh, no, Chaksia, bro. I get what you mean, but also get what so, Irish means. I know, I, I hear you. Mm-hmm. All I'm saying is, this is real life, things happen, mm-hmm. and as much as, that's our food. Yeah. This is real life, things happen, mm-hmm. and we have to live with the truth of what our society is about. But then it begs the question, like, where yeah. does creativity and morality... Draw the, like, line. the line. You understand? Where's the like, line? where's you know? the there's fine no, there's line? There's no line, bro. There's and no that's line. the this thing, is where, This is where, the thing is, and the same thing, mm-hmm. we will never agree on this. Because you have your own opinions and that's because of your belief systems and many things. Yeah. Same with you. It's like morality. What is moral anymore? Mm-hmm. Who defines what morality is? We'll never agree on it. Mm-hmm. And that's fine. Mm-hmm. I'm just saying, as someone who's interested in stories, we have to be real about real life. Yep. We, could, we, we can't have stigma or, or bad things. When people die, people die in such, grues- in such a gruesome manner, mm. and we're like, we can't tell that story. The Rwanda genocide happened, and now we can't tell that story. Mm. They have a whole museum dedicated for... Mm-hmm. This actually happened. People the died. world is fucked up, and we'll own up to this happened. Yeah. We have to tell those stories because it's real life, bro. Yeah. Regardless of people will be affected, regardless of whether they tell these stories or not. True. But people died, and you're telling me mm. we cannot tell the world that this, this, this happened, happened, and be on the lookout. Mm. Be on the lookout. Yeah, yeah don't We can prevent such things happening. When we can openly own up to bullshit happens and these people should not be... Do you know how many years it took for that d- nigga to be arrested? So, and you're yeah, telling me we can't own up and be like, yo, this fucking happened bus, bus, and bus. learn from it. Bus, 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 yeah. bus. Be real with life, man. <laughs> bus, like, we, bus, we can't sugarcoat like, like, things. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Bus, so bus, you don't tell me, oh, Usain Bolt, the biggest sprint in the world. Good story. We do a documentary, Right. But on Nyancha killed people in Kenya and like we hide it. Okay, okay. We have to tell the story but on Nyancha I, okay, because just, 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 unless we tell that story, no, no, more ska, people are gonna be victims. No, no, I think I think what I was trying to say is, is it's not that we don't tell the stories, just perspective. How you do you how do you tell the story? When you talk about the genocide, say in, in Rwanda, there's a way we talk about it. Yeah. It's perspective. Yes. It's how do you tell the story? Who 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 are you? So it's a documentary. A documentary to. means Fox. documenting. So how do you want me to no, I'll say I'll say lead with empathy. Yeah. It's these families are involved. Because listen, like, so for me, for okay, so listen, how, do cover, how, how do you cover his story for with this, empathy? Listen, Tell me how like, do you okay, cover okay, for somebody okay. who watches a lot of true crime documentaries, I'll say this. Mm. Because I've um there is like sort of the same thing. There's Ted Bundy, there's John Wayne Gacy. There's so there's so many on mm. Netflix. But even when I was watching Ted, but listen, Ted Bundy and John Wayne Gacy did the most despicable things. Close to Jeffrey Dahmer. Mm-hmm. But the way they tell these stories, it's a bit more, okay, like, I can take it. Mm. It's gruesome. I can understand the extent of the gruesomeness. I get it. Yeah. But the way the story is being told, I can stomach it. Jeffrey Dahmer, it's to an extent where it's like... So how should I have been told? Answer me. How should I... Have, how should... Like, you, you said you've watched a lot. A bit how, how? empathy. No, how? Okay, so that's, I get that's not a blanket statement. How? I get how? it. Yes, 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 okay, yes, how? I, mean. I get he was keeping the heads. I get he was doing all these things. You don't need to show me how he was keeping the heads. No, no, no. You boxes. can show. You can show no, everything. No, 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 no. Here's no, what no. I'm saying. Leading with empathy means you put the families of the victims of the people who have... Into consideration. Tell me how. By just talking to them. You know? Talking to them and telling them we're making it. Because so why are, where are they getting no, no, these no, stories? Some people where, where is the documentary? Based I, saw, on I saw a tweet. Yeah. Some people found out mm. that okay, so this thing happened in the nineties, you know? Yeah. Mm. And then now you're in two thousand and twenty-two. You're watching Netflix. 
You see, like, oh, there's an Israel killer TV, whatever. So yeah. Is. You click on it, mm. it's the story of how your uncle died, or your brother, or your sister, or your you mother, understand. or your whatever. You know? mm -hmm. like, no, because he was, the, he was only killing black men. He killed six black men. No, mm. 11 black men mm -hmm. and six white men. And there are others who people don't even know mm. who, but he's only he only owned up to 17 Times. So my question is, you reach out to the family and tell them there's this doc you're working on is coming out. Yes. Yeah. And then, just, okay, yeah. so you reach out to the family and then? The, so family then says, the family says, we don't feel like this should go out then? Don't air their story. It's, it's not about reaching out to them for There could consent. be other 12 families that agreed. No, 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 no. So no. are they airing, are they airing, are they airing stories about the families or stories? No, no, about, no. Because no, no. remember again, saying. they're recreating a lot of this thing you're watching. The family it's not like they recorded the footage you're seeing. They recreate because it's That's dramatic. It's 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 no, but even at some point they were putting like the actual calls that one of his neighbors was making to the police. Yeah, That's okay. Yeah, Me but you're not reaching out to the families for consent. You're reaching out to them for. We're so doing so this. so this so you don't yeah. So you don't think the families they reach out to the families. They, they did reach out to the families. But actually, if I they say no, I have families. a right to say they no. Didn't. Of course, but it's not at the end of the day. It's you not right your, to say it's no, not but it's not your story to tell. Yes. If I say no, I've said no. So, so if the, if a family says no, you cut out their story from the document. Yes, it is not your story to tell. No, I've can't. said okay. no. Bits and pieces. Okay. Let us know what you guys think in the comment section. Yeah, we never do. agree on this. Yeah. We have room for one more story, no? How many? How long have we been rolling? One hour. One okay. Hour ten so one more okay, story. So yeah. We can do two. One. Let's do one more. Okay. Yeah. Uh. So one more. Shit. Just that was such a sensitive story, man. Right? <laughs> but yeah, you guys check it out. But honestly, we'd love to know what you guys think. You yeah. Know what I mean? yeah. Uh, personally, I'm for all for... We just have to own up some things. It's mm. real life, you know what I mean? Uh, but into... Good news. So that we can smile. Yeah. On a lighter sign, note. On a lighter <laughs> note. Shout out to Trevor Noah, man. Yeah. So Trevor Noah announced he's leaving The Daily Show after seven, seven years. Seven freaking years. Seven years stint. He's done a good Shit. job. Yeah. Bro, do you know how much of a legend Trevor is? Bro, you know me. I He's watch done the team. I know you. Trevor is one yeah, of you, the you're the biggest fan. Yeah, he's the biggest Trevor honestly. fan. Honestly, yeah. literally, yeah. Trevor. No, like the day I meet him, I'm gonna faint. It's like Omanyala or Usain Bolt or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like me and Dave Chappelle. Yeah, bro. After Dave, you know how people say that one person would like to have dinner with. What's this? I'm at two. I'm at two hundred and fifty G's. Who are you bro. choosing? Yeah. Me, me, of course, at a dinner with Jay-Z, I must do for money. Yeah. I'm taking the money. Because I'll meet Jay-Z when I meet. <laughs> <laughs> when you, Yo, when Trevor, you have the money, no, you can somehow Let me tell you, my favorite thing about Trevor is, it's just, it's his his view of of things and how they happen. It's very, like you can it's very interesting. Yeah, we all experience the same world, yeah? But the way he puts it out. Yeah. And then how he, his, his jokes usually have a punchline and then an extra punchline. Yeah. And, and also, um, like even him being like an African host of a show that was predominantly white for a long time. Yeah. And then it's a... On the biggest stage in the world. Yeah. Biggest stage in the world, yeah. bro. My favorite part about The Daily Show was, and, and I'll keep saying this, it's the in-between scenes. He calls it, what, what does he call it? Between the scenes. No, you would tell us. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm not like, I, lo I love Yo. to travel like that, but I'm <coughs> but I don't not a big fan like, like that, that. So, either. Yeah. No, no, no. Be between the scenes. You know how like he's always okay. You can see the Daily Show in its entirety, mm -hmm. but then before that, before like they roll, you see how we have banter before we yeah. action. Yeah. yeah, he does that with the audience all the time. Yeah, he takes fire. questions, that's and fire. it's like a podcast. It's like a three, five, ten minute thingy. Yeah. That's he dope. just talks to people, and he he's always so fucking profound, yeah. and he's fucking dualipa. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's a good point to end it, right? Yeah. Shout out to Trevor Noah. Trevor Episode Noah, 3, man. we are match up! My check! Over 26. <laughs> this is the Burger Podcast. This is the Brunch Club. Over 26. Come back to the Burger Podcast. The mics are cool. Now, when you watch it, you'll understand. <laughs>